Hey guys, good evening. Welcome to the class. Can you hear me? Me escuchan, chicos? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Thank you. I just wanted to confirm that you were able to hear me. Thank you very much. Okay. okay. So welcome to your class, guys. Today's, uh, today we're, we're going to have a session number 15, right? Session number 15. So tomorrow we're going to be finishing a um, Principiantes 3, right? So, and then you're going to start your Principiantes 4. Así que welcome, everyone. Thank you very much for joining. Just let me go ahead and share the screen right now. <clears throat> well, guys, today what I want to do is to check a little bit um, the simple past of verbs, okay? I don't know if you have practiced, right? But if, if you haven't, don't worry because we're going to have everyone's help, okay? Entre todos nos vamos a ir. Give me one second. <clears throat> there we go. So I was saying today uh, we're, go we're, we're going to have our session number 15, so thank you very much for joining. Okay, les debo la información. Yo sé que no se las mandé antes que me vayan a preguntar. Pero sí, la verdad es que estuve bastante ocupadita este día, <coughs> a tal grado pues que no, no pude, eh, digamos, tener ese tiempito, pero eh, I know that uh, tomorrow I'm going to send you the information. Tomorrow is our last session. Mañana es nuestra última sesión. Remember that uh, by tomorrow, right, um, you should have uh, completed, right, the section number five. Y mañana, la clase de mañana, recuerden también, se dedica al final exam, ¿ok? Así que si llegó al final exam, and if you have questions, el día jueves se dedica eso para el final exam, y pues se van viendo cada uno de los puntos que tenemos ahí. A menos que ustedes tengan alguna pregunta de la plataforma, ¿verdad? Y la traen hoy a la clase, ¿verdad? We can go ahead and do that as well. And, well, let me go ahead and uh, take a look at the verbs. Uh, let me open up here the list. ¿Se acuerdan de la lista que les mandé? Yes, teacher. Very good. So, we're going to use it today. Just let me open it up. Y ya lo vamos a... Okay. What verbs do you, uh, well, no, yo les diré el verbo, okay? What is the simple past, guys? And you can use it, you can use the chat, okay? What is the simple past of the verb think? Think. What is the simple past of the verb think? Go to the chat, please. Let me see. I have the chat here already. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. It's thought. Very, very, very fast. Boris. That was quick. Okay. Uh, that was uh, the verb think is thought. Muy bien. Excellent. Let me open the list. Aquí la tengo. Bye. What about this one? What is the simple past? What is the simple past of the verb? No, I will type it in the chat. What is the simple past of the verb? Begin. Begin. What is a simple past? Okay, very good. Very quick. Very, very, very um, interesting here. Lots of you are answering through the chat. Okay, so we got, yeah, begun. Excellent. What about the next one? What is a simple past of the verb? Drink. Drink. What is the simple past of this verb? Okay, very good, excellent. That's drank, okay. What is the simple past of the verb do? Do, what is the simple past of the verb do? Okay, very good, excellent. What about this one? What is the simple past of the verb Drive, oops, sorry, drive, okay, drive. Okay, good job, excellent, very good. 
what is a simple past? Let's see. What is a simple past of the verb? Hmm. This one. Eat. Eat. What is a simple past of the verb? Excellent. Very good. What about this one? What is the simple past? Y aquí nos equivocamos bastante, fíjense. What is the simple past of the verb? Fall. Right? Fall. Okay. Ajá. Y ahí, ahí Débora, ese es otro verbo. Okay. Ajá. Muy bien, muy bien. Excellent, right? Por eso le decía, a veces nos confundimos. Ahora sí, Débora, ahora sí. What is the simple past of the verb? Feel, feel, uh huh. There, okay, feel. Muy bien. Ahora sí, Deborah. Exactly. Okay. Give me one second. Pizarra. Oops. What is the simple past of the verb? Ah, this one. This one. The verb find. What is the simple past of the verb find? Okay, very good, excellent. Ya vi que han estudiado, chicos, very good. Vaya, vamos a ver. What is the simple past of the verb fly? Fly. Excellent, very good. Flu, okay. Oh, let me let me see. Let me see. Um, what is the simple past of the verb right? Right. Okay. Excellent. Good job. Very good. Very good. Okay. What about this one? What about this one? What is and, and this one also? It's kind of confusing. A veces nos confunde. What is the simple past of the verb wear? Vestir. Where? Mm -hmm. Boris, ahí le faltó una, una letra, Boris. <laughs> okay, very good. Word. What, what is the simple past of the <clears throat> verb? This one. Forget. Forget. Very good. Excellent. Excellent. Um, what is the simple past of the... Oh, this one. Ese también a veces nos confunde. Of the verb. Tell. Tell. Exactly. Very good. That's the verb tell. Okay. Uh -huh. Tell, yes. Okay. What about this one? What is the simple past of the verb? Ah, this one. Get. Get. Okay. Okay, very good. What about the simple past? Uh, oh, this one. The simple past of the verb. Teach. Teach. Mm -hmm. I'm going to start sharing the, the una pizarra, permitan. One, one moment. One second. Mm -hmm. Solo comparto la pizarra, chicos, permítanme. Ahí está. Thank you very much. Okay. So let me see the chat. Let me see the chat. Okay. Yes. That is taught. Very good. The simple pass of the verb teach is taught. Taught like this. Okay. What about this one? What is the simple pass of the verb? Uh, this one, give, oops, sorry, give, okay, 
give. Okay, very good. Excellent. What is the simple past of the verb? Ah, this one. Swim. Swim. Okay, very good. That's one. Excellent. Huh. What is the simple past of the verb? This one. Go. Go. Muy bien. Bueno. Excellent. Uh -huh. Very good. Excellent. And let me see. What is the simple past of the verb? Speak. Speak. Very good. Excellent. Anita Explore. viene con esos deditos, pero... Okay. Very good, Anita. Okay. La primerita. Eh? What about the next one? What about uh, the simple past of the verb? Oh, this one. Hear. Escuchar. Hear. Very good. Okay, heard. Very good, Boris. Okay. Solo Boris me ha respondido. What about the rest? Okay. What is the simple past of the verb? Oh, this one. No. Saber. No. Mm-hmm. Very good, excellent, excellent. What about the simple past of the verb sleep? Sleep. Sleep. Muy bien, excellent, very good. Okay, what about the simple past of the verb leave? Leave. Mm -hmm. Like your left hand, right, left. Very good. Excellent. Well, de verdad que sí. Me han sorprendido, chicos. Han estudiado. That's a very, that's something very, very good. You did a great job. And now we're going to continue with some sentences, right? So we're going to have a review today, right? And let me check. Give me one second. I'm going to open here. Una pizarrita. Vaya, chicos. So I'll go today with your names. Okay. Me voy a ir con los nombres hoy. Vamos a ver. So I'm going to, we're going to do the following. Okay. Uh, we're going to practice with the simple past and the structures that we have studied. Right. And I'm going to give you one verb. Okay. I'm going to give you one verb. And what I want you to do is to think about a, a sentence, right? Once we have your well, once you have your sentence, I'm sorry, you're going to then make uh, the same sentence into the negative form and then to the question form. Si tiene problemas, igual nosotros le vamos a ir tranquilo, okay? So let's see, vamos a ver primer verbo. And this is going to be an example, okay? Visit, okay? So let's go ahead and think of a sentence, right? With the verb visit. For example, I visited my sister well, last week, right? Last week. Okay. So this is my sentence, okay? How do I convert the sentence into the negative form? ¿Qué le voy a agregar? Did. Muy bien. Didn't. didn't. Okay. Didn't. Very good. And then what else? Visit. Visit. Okay. Y modifico o no mi verbo? No. no porque es el auxiliar. Muy bien. Okay. I didn't visit my sister last, last weekend. weekend. Okay. Very good. And now, what about the question? Did 
Muy bien. We start or we we begin with the auxiliary and then I visit. I visit my sister last week. Okay, you can say did I or did you, right? Did you visit? Okay, your sister. Porque soy un poco rara preguntarse a uno mismo las preguntas. Eh, o hacerse, perdón, a uno mismo las preguntas. Did you visit your sister last weekend, right? Okay, very good. So this is the first, this is my example, okay? So then I want you to think of a verb. Váyanse a la lista, no se lo voy a dar yo, okay? Pick, pick one verb, okay? Or choose one verb from the list. And then I'm going to call your name and you will have to do the same, ¿ok? Lo mismo que yo acabo de hacer ahorita, lo van a hacer ustedes. Así que tengan ya listo el verbo que van a utilizar, ¿ok? Solo le contesto a uno de ustedes que me dice que ha tenido problemas. Pero... Eh, Think of, a, of your verb, ¿ok? Mientras tanto le voy a responder a Dayana, de mi momentito. Okay. Uh huh. Are you ready, guys? Raise your hands. Uh, I mean, raise your hand if you're ready, please. Quiero ver el mi primer voluntario. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Basilia. Basilia, please uh, tell us your verb. What verb do you choose? Hmm? Which one? Bow and pass. Bow. Okay. I bow shoes, shoes yesterday. Okay. I didn't bow shoes yesterday. Did you bow shoes yesterday? Mm. Repeat, repeat it one more time. The first sentence and then negative and question for Basilia. One more time. Um, negative. No. Uh, can you tell me the three sentences one more time? And the verb is, is by. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, and pass is bow. Muy bien. Excellent. I bow shoes yesterday. Okay. I didn't bow shoes yesterday. Okay. What is the mistake there, uh, Basilia? Um... I didn't. Ah, I didn't buy. Excellent. Very good. Okay. And what Thank about? You. You're welcome. What about the question? Uh, did you buy shoes yesterday? Okay. Very good. Or you can say I bought a pair of shoes. Right. A pair of shoes. Okay. To be uh, more specific. So thank you very much, Vasilia. Good job. Now, now, Vasilia, you pick the next person. Okay. Choose the next person, please. Emma Aguilar? Eh, Emma, 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 huh? Emma. Emma, are you there? Are you ready with your, uh, bueno, Anita también está ahí este, diciendo. Sí. Que, es Anita. Que bueno, entonces después de Emma nos va a... Eh, eh, Va a seguir Anita, okay? So, Emma, what, uh, what is the verb? I mean, tell look. me the verb, I'm sorry, that you chose. Look. Which look. one? Look. Look. Okay, very good. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Tell me, what is your sentence? I, I looked my computer last night. Um, but... You see, the verb, the verb is loose, right? And then... Quiero decir the perder. Mm -hmm. Sí, perder. Quiero, es lo que quiero. In past. Look. No, last. Muy bien. Okay. Lost. Continue. I lost my computer last night. Excellent. Negative. 
I didn't lost my computer last night. I didn't what? I didn't? Lose. Very good. Okay, and the question? Did you lose computer last night? Did you, did you lose the computer oh, last night? Yes. Okay, very good job, Emma. Thank you very much. Okay, what about Anita? My verb is sent. Sent, okay, very good. Give me one second. This one, Anita? Yes. Very good. Tell me your sentence. I sent email to my coworker. Sent, but I sent an email to my coworker. Coworker. Continue, Anita. I didn't send email to my coworker. And the question? Did did you send email to your coworker? Okay, very good. Excellent. Thank you very much, Anita. Okay, Anita, who is next? Boris. Boris. Okay, Boris. Let me see. Hi. Hi, Boris. Okay. The uh, drive. Drive. Okay. Very good. Excellent. I drove my car yesterday. Okay. I I didn't drive my car yesterday. Mm -hmm. Did you drive my car yesterday? Okay, very good. Good job, Boris. Thank you very much. Who's next? Uh, Alejandra Cortez. Alejandra Cortez, are you here? Ale, Ale. Bueno, parece que no está aquí. Es no, Alex. Débora. Débora, ok. Débora. Okay. ok, tell me. Ajá. ¿Cuál es su verbo? Uh, my verb, my, my, my. Uh, uh, my verb is. Um, Went. Repeat it. Went. So go, right? Go in person. Very good. Ayer uh, uh, past, I went to the park. Yesterday. Okay, very good. Excellent. Negative. I didn't uh, the park. I I no. I the bird. I did. I didn't go to the park yesterday. Very good. Okay. Uh, did you go? To the park yesterday. Okay, muy bien. Excellent, very good. Good job, Deborah. Who is next? Um, Sarai. Sarai, are you here, Sarai? Yes. Excellent, Sarai. Tell me the verb. Uh, it was go. Go, okay. I, I went shopping yesterday. Okay. Uh, I didn't go shopping yesterday. Did you go shopping yesterday? Okay, did you go shopping yesterday? Very good, excellent. Thank you very much, Sarai, okay? Sarai, who's next? Um, Edgar. Edgar, okay. Edgar, are you here? Edgar? Bueno, it's... No se escucha ahí, así que you can um, choose someone else, eh, Sarai. Ailey. Michelle. Ailey Michelle. Ailey Michelle, ajá. Uh -huh. Ella. Yeah. Oh, no. It. It, okay, very good. Eh, um, 
I ate with my parents. I didn't eat with my parents. Uh, did you eat with my parents? Okay, I ate. You can add it, something, right? I ate dinner, right, with my parents. Okay, very good. Excellent. Cabal el orden. I leave show. Very good. Thank you very much. Who's next? Um, no aparece nadie. <laughs> Vaya, pasó Anita, ya pasó Débora, you, Sarai. Um, let me see. Araceli. Araceli. Ok. Um, yo escogí run. Which one? Run. 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 I ran with my friends yesterday. Ajá. Uh -huh. I didn't run with my friends yesterday. Did you run with your friends yesterday? Okay, very good. Okay, I ran with my friends, right? With my friends yesterday. Muy bien. Just the pronunciation, right? Run, ran, right? Run, ran. Okay, very good. Thank you very much, uh, Araceli. Who is next? ¿Quién sigue, Araceli? ¿Quién nos falta? Yo. Um, who said yo? Uh, okay. uh, es que me estaba espera. lavando las manos. Ah, oh. ok, Edgar. Bueno, well, vamos a dejar a Edgar que participe. Thank you, Araceli, very much, ok. Ajá, Edgar. I, I slept all day yesterday. Is it true? ¿Es cierto? Is it true? No. <laughs> ok, dígame I slept uh -huh. All day yesterday Ok You can say all day long También, all day long Yesterday, todo el día Ok ¿En Negative Edgar mm, Negative mm -hmm. I didn't I didn't Sleep all day yesterday. In question form? Did you sleep all day yesterday? Very good. Excellent. Thank you, Edgar. ¿Quién nos falta? Edgar, take a look at the list. We got Flor. Ah. Cecilia. ¿Quién me dijo yo, teacher? Dina. Dina. Ana okay. del Carmen también. Anita del Carmen también, okay. Así que, let's see. Um, bueno. Let's see. Uh, ¿Quién dijo primero yo? No me acuerdo. Eh, Dina, ¿verdad? Dina? Okay. 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 Tell me my, your verb. Teacher, my verb uh, is drive. Drive, okay. Very good. Drive. Mm -hmm. I drove at work in the morning. I drove work in the morning. I drove to work, perdón. To work. I drove. Two in the morning. Uh -huh. Okay. I didn't drive to work in the morning. Um, his question. Mm -hmm. Did you drive uh, to work in the morning? Okay. Thank you very much. Did you drive? I didn't drive. Okay. I drove. Thank you very much, Dina. What about Anita del Carmen? Uh, el verbo es uh, drink. Drink, okay, very good. Dígame, Anita. I drank uh, soda yesterday. Okay, I drank soda yesterday. Very good. Negative. I didn't drink uh, soda yesterday. Mm -hmm. Y uh, did you drink soda? Okay, did you drink soda yesterday? Very good. Thank you, Anita. ¿Quién nos falta? Hablamos. Flor, are you here? Yes. Okay, Flor, tell me the verb. El verbo let. El let. Let. This one? Sí. Okay, very good. Uh, I let in I for my friend on Sunday. Oh, pero let es permitir. No es dejar, no. en el aeropuerto. 
Ah, me sería eh, el leave es cuando usted, por ejemplo, you leave, se va de un lugar, ¿verdad? Eh, I left early, right? Me fui temprano. Yo creo que el que usted quiere usar es take, right? Y la oración. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, Porque uh, era como de dejar en el aeropuerto a, a mi amiga el, el domingo. I took <coughs> my friend to the airport last Sunday. Nos quedaría así este florcita. Ah, va. Uh -huh. Entonces Take. el negativo sería I didn't took my friend to the mm. airport last Sunday. Mm, hay un error ahí. ¿Cuál sería? El verbo. ¿Por qué? El pasado. Porque en, en es de ponerle en <coughs> pasado. En forma base. En forma, ajá, en take, entonces. Ajá, repeat one more time. Repeat it one entonces, more time. I didn't mm -hmm. take my friend to the airport last Sunday. Correct. And the question? <coughs> Did you take <coughs> your friend? To the airport last Sunday. Excellent. Good job. Ok, ya está. Le hice el cambio ahí del, del possessive. Gracias. Así que you're welcome, ok. ¿Alguien que me haga falta, chicos? <coughs> Raise your hand. Creo que ahí estamos todos, ¿verdad? Let me see. Así escaneando rapidito. Yes, I think everybody has passed. Adriana, hello. Adriana, would you like to participate? <coughs> Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you, Adriana? I'm fine. Excellent. Welcome to the class. Would you like to participate? Thank you. Yes. Excellent. Tell me one verb and then you can see the examples that we just... Puede ser cualquiera. Yes, any verb. Okay. Sería... Um, uh, call. This one? This one? Pero ver. Hey. Sería, I call it. Mm -hmm. I call it. My mom in Saturday. My mom last Saturday. Okay. I called my mom. I called my mom last Saturday. Okay. Negative form. Um. Sería, I, I didn't, mm -hmm. I didn't call my mom last Saturday. Okay, very good. And the question four? Mm. Did my, did my mom, sería así, did my mom, me acuerdo. Or did you, right? Did you call, así como, como la persona. Ah, ok. Did you call your mom mm -hmm. last Saturday? Last Saturday. Ok, very good. Excellent. Thank you Thank very you. much. You're welcome. Thank you for participating. Ok, chicos. This is about simple past, ok? You did great, ok. Solamente eso, ¿verdad? Que siempre se nos olvida que no debemos cambiar el verbo, no debemos aplicarle ninguna regla o decirlo en pasado si ya estamos usando un auxiliar, ¿verdad? Por lo demás, chicos, muy buen trabajo y de verdad los felicito, fíjense, porque si sí estudiaron los verbos y veo que pues tienen una idea bastante buena. Al menos esa lista básica que estábamos estudiando, ¿verdad? Les va a servir de mucho. Let me clear all my drawings. Ok. Bueno, chicos, eh, aparte de eso, aparte pues estar practicando, eh, eh, en este caso, pues el um, simple past con todos los verbos, ¿verdad? También vimos ayer y pues eh, antes vimos una introducción de lo que era el past of verb B, ¿ok? Uh, the past of verb B, we say, it, we, to, uh, we use it to talk about states, right? Cómo nos, senti cómo nos sentimos o cómo estamos, ¿verdad? O en este caso, eh, pues que en español significa ser o estar, dependiendo de cuál es el, el, el significado que le vamos a dar, ¿verdad? Así que vamos a ver. I'm going to show you one more time, ¿ok? 
uh, this activity and we did it, we did it um, last Saturday, last Saturday, last class, I'm sorry. We did it last class, creo que fue la semana pasada. Okay, so I'm going to give you some hints and uh, ustedes van a armar sus oraciones, pero en este caso no vamos a hacerlo con simple past de los otros verbos, sino que simple past con el verbo to be. Okay, give me one second. Let me show it here. Bye. Let me see. Oops. Voy a cerrar acá. Vaya, chicos. Now, let's go ahead and uh, see how we are going to uh, make up our sentences, okay? ¿Se acuerdan que este lo, lo jugamos la semana pasada? Pero lo jugamos de una forma distinta, ¿verdad? Esta vez lo vamos a hacer con simple past, okay? Del verbo to be. Por ejemplo, you have a, my brother, you have I, my mom, Helen, and Tom. And you know what? Let's go ahead and nod here. A, Feelings, okay. Um, happy, and let's have here uh, bored. Okay, bored. Very good. Entonces vamos a ocupar todos estos que están acá y vamos a hacer nuestras oraciones. Por ejemplo, I'm going to be, give you the example first, okay? The following example is going to be text acá. Digamos que yo ocupo um, my brother, ¿ok? Voy a ocupar my brother y voy a escoger un lugar de los que no está ahí, ¿verdad? Eh, borramos, creo yo, que uh, park, ¿verdad? Park. My brother was in or at, ¿verdad? Was in the park, oops, yesterday afternoon, ¿ok? My brother was in the park yesterday afternoon. Fíjense bien, yo les doy a ustedes el subject y el lugar, ¿ok? And you are going to make up your sentences, ¿ok? Entonces, ¿cómo yo digo esta oración en, en, en negativo? Vamos a ver, ¿cómo nos quedaría? My brother was in... Oh, ok. Muy bien. My brother... Oops. My brother... Wasn't okay. in the park yesterday afternoon. Okay, and the question, ¿cómo nos quedaría la pregunta? Was my brother. Okay, was my brother in the park yesterday afternoon. Very good, yesterday afternoon. Ok, entonces yo voy a ocupar uno de los subjects que tengo aquí a mi, uy, qué lejos me siento yo de, de, la, de la cámara, perdón. Eh, I'm going to use eh, the subjects that I have on the, on the left, and then the um, places and, um, you know, uh, feelings que tengo en la parte de arriba, in the upper section, ok. Así que vamos a comenzar. Necesito el primero, sí, un volunteer. Volunteer, please, raise your hand. Uno y de ahí pues van a ir escogiendo a ellos quien quieren que, que continúe, ¿ok? Volunteer. Ah, mi teacher. Go ahead. Araceli Alarcón. Vaya Araceli, dígame. Eh, yo escogí um, party. Party, ok, very good. Um, last weekend. Party was happy. Ok, vamos a ver. Porque hay muchos elementos. Está last weekend, está party y está happy. Uh, Puedo decir algo así. I, pero ahí sí ya sería. I was happy at the party last weekend. Ok. I was, porque tengo que usar el verbo to be, ok? So I was happy at the party last weekend, ok? ¿Cómo nos quedaría la oración negativa, Araceli? Um, I wasn't. Uh -huh. um, I wasn't um, party. No, pero ¿y el adjetivo? Uh -huh. I wasn't happy 
at the party last weekend. Mm -hmm. And the question? And, and what? i happy at the party last weekend. Very good. You can ask the question right to yourself if you want. Uh -huh. Or were you, Tami? Were you happy at the party last weekend? Okay, muy bien. Thank you very much, Araceli. Can you please um, choose someone else? Bueno, Adriana se, se levanta la varita y ya quiere ser volunteer. Gracias, okay. Araceli. Thank you. Adriana, tell me. Eh, sería con my brother y el otro creo que era house. El pasado Ay. primero. Por cierto, permítame, Adrianita. I was happy, ¿verdad? Ella escogió I y escogió, escogió happy. Ok. Voy a borrar, clear on my drawings. Escogió I and happy. Oops. Sorry, ahí está. No points. Ok, thank you. Adriana, tell me. Yeah, my brother in house. My brother in my house. Brother, my brother was at his girlfriend's house. Ok, my brother was at his girlfriend's house. Very good. In the negative form? Um, my brother wasn't mm -hmm. at his girlfriend's house. Okay, and the question form? Was my brother at his girlfriend's house? Excellent, very good. So, thank you very much, Adriana Braxel. We have no points here, but thank you. And Adriana, you choose the next person. Um, Basilia. Basilia, thank you very much. Helen and Tom. Okay. And work. And work, okay. Muy bien. Helen and Tom were work in the office. Okay. Helen and Tom were at work, ¿verdad? Bueno. Si quieren, para que no los confunda, aunque usted lo utilizó bien, este, eh, Basilia, no se preocupe, pero le voy a poner quizás office para que no se confundan con el verbo, ¿ok? So, pero si lo hizo bien usted, tranquila, lo hago yo porque no sé que se confundan con el verbo, ajá. Helen and Tom weren't at office. Question. Eh, were, were Helen and Tom at office? Very good. Excellent. Okay, Helen and Tom and office. Let's see. Sorry, Basilia, but actually we have no points. Thank you very much. Who's next? ¿Quién sigue? Sarai. Sarai, thank you very much. Sarai? Okay, um, my mom. Okay. Um, uh, ah, es que lo cambiamos por office para que no se fueran a confundir con el verbo. House, okay. No problem. Uh, my mom uh, was a uh, clean house. Pero ese ya es, ya es pasado progresivo. Solo Sería. usa el verbo. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, pero entonces my mom. Eh, pero ¿cómo sería para decir que él eh, limpia mucho? Pero es que entonces el verbo ya cambia, ya es clean. Y ahorita solo estamos haciéndolo con el verbo to be, verbo cero es. Ok. Ah, ok. Entonces sería, my mom was, um... Ok, lo voy a cambiar por happy. My okay. mom was happy in my house. Ok, very good, excellent. Uh -huh. Negative form? Okay, uh, my mom uh, uh, was in my house, uh, happy in my house. Very good. And the uh, negative form? The negative I know, I'm sorry, the, the question the form. Question. Uh, was, was my mom uh, happy in my house? Very good. Okay, my mom and happy, but no points, Sarai, but thank you very much. Y eso que le sucedió a Sarai, chicos, es lo que de repente nos pasa, fíjense. Se nos olvida, ¿verdad? Cuando nosotros eh, vamos a hablar en pasado con cualquier otro verbo, Entonces aplica todo lo que acabamos de ver en el ejercicio anterior, ¿verdad? Eh, 
las oraciones afirmativas se cambian, eh, perdón, el verbo cambia en las oraciones afirmativas, ¿verdad? Y por eso es que lo debemos, a, nos lo debemos de memorizar y saber las reglas. Luego en el negativo, yo sé que voy a usar didn't y en las preguntas did, pero luego nos pasa como, lo, como, como el ejemplo de estar ahí, ¿verdad? Que de eso nos quedamos. Eh, uso el was con otro verbo, pero cuando estamos hablando de pasado progresivo. Por ejemplo, la oración que ella me decía estaba bien. My mom was cleaning. Ok, the house. Y ahí ella puede especificar ahí en qué momento lo estaba haciendo, ¿verdad? Entonces, pero ese ya es pasado progresivo. Pero en este caso, estamos usando el verbo to be solito, ¿ok? Y pues lo que hablábamos ayer, el verbo to be es independiente. No es como eh, los otros verbos que necesitan ayuda con did y didn't, ¿verdad? El verbo to be, el solito es, es afirmativo, negativo y pregunta. ¿Verdad? Así que thank you very much, Sarayu, for your example. Y también me sirvió para, para aclarar ese punto. Thank you very much, ¿ok? okay y, you. ok, vamos a seguir. Sarayu, who's next? Yo, teacher. Ah, oh, vaya, yo dijeron Ay, aquí, Sarayu. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Salir ya con esto me mata la presión. <laughs> Tan bella. Let's go ahead and, 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 and uh, hear uh, the sentence you have. My brother and Boris. Uh -huh, my brother in work, okay? Uh, my brother was was boarded in the house. Okay. Um, my brother wasn't boarded in the house. Mm -hmm. Was my brother boarded in the house? Excellent, very good. Just a pronunciation, remember, board. 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 Mm -hmm. Pero ahí la oración super bien. Thank you very much, Ali Michel. Veamos. <laughs> No points. Hey, ¿Qué pasó, chicos? <ríe> Miren que hoy nadie ha encontrado ningún punto, ni un anillito, ni unos aritos en otro. <ríe> ok, vamos a ver. Eh, Ailey, who's next? Veamos la lista, porque no hay volunteers ahorita. Ajá. Sí, teacher, yo. Ah, vaya, Anita dice, vaya. Ahí está, Ailey, Michelle. Thank you. Go ahead. Uh, my mom, party. Ajá. My mom and party, ok. My mom was in the party. Saturday. Okay. Uh, my mom wasn't in the party Saturday. Okay. Question. Uh, was my mom at the party Saturday? Okay, very good. Yo solo ahí le agregaría un on. On Saturday, ¿verdad? El sábado, on Saturday. Oh. Mm -hmm. At last three, oh. ¿verdad? On. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Muy on. bien. On, sí. On Saturday. Vamos a ver. ¿Cuánto me gané? <gasps> Diez moneditas, Anita. Algo es algo, eh. Okay, very good. Excellent. Okay. Thank you. Who's next, Anita? La primerita, ¿verdad? Que encuentra pistillo debajo de las, de las casillas. Boris. Boris, ya Boris. pasó. Boris, no. Boris, are you there? Ay, no, que no veo la lista. Así que uno. Hi, Boris. Yeah. Okay, tell Hi. me. Uh, my mom and board. Okay, very good. My mom. My mom was bored yesterday. Okay. My mom wasn't bored yesterday. Mm -hmm. Was my mom bored yesterday? Very good. Good job. And let's see. No points uh, for it. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Ahí solo Anita es la del pistillo ahorita, okay? <laughs> Vaya. Who's next, Boris? Um... Basilia, voy a Basilia, pasar Basilia. Sí, sí, ella. Mi ella teacher. Pasó. Vaya, dijeron mi, who said me. Ok, Tina. Okay. Tina creo que fue. No, quiero okay. ver. Ok, Tina. Tina, sí, sí, ajá. Uh, Helen and Tom. Helen and Tom, ok. Helen and Tom. Uh -huh. Helen and Tom. Um, where? Uh -huh. Where? Um, the party on, on Sunday? Okay, Helen and Tom were in the party last okay. Sunday. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, negative. Mm -hmm. uh, Helen, um, Helen and Tom uh, wearing, mm -hmm. wearing um, the party on Sunday. Very good. Uh, the question. Um, Helen and Tom uh, Where? No, porque entonces ahí hay un switch cuando tenemos no. la pregunta. Ok, sorry, sorry. Don't worry, it's ok. Um, where? Mm -hmm. Where your... 
o se podría decir, sorry, eh, where Helen they. and Tom. Ajá, uh -huh. where Helen and Tom, or where they. Where Helen and Tom, um, the party of Sunday. Okay, last Sunday. Very good. Excellent. Thank you very much, Chilina. Let's okay. see. Helen Thank and you. Tom and party. You're welcome. <gasps> no points. Okay. <laughs> okay, vamos a ver. Who's next? Yo, teacher. Okay. Yo, teacher. Vaya, vaya. Who's that? Yo, Flor. Flor. Okay, vaya, Florcita. Flor. Dale. My mom was in the house of the my sister. Okay, entonces en ese caso sería my mom was in my sister's house. In my sister's house. Mm -hmm. My mom wasn't in my sister's house. Very good. Was my mom in the my sister's house? In my sister's house. Very good. I se lo puse en el chat. Excellent. So my mom and in house. Okay, let's see. She found a ring. Okay, Yay. very good. Yay. <laughs> okay, 50 <laughs> points, uh <-huh>. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, very good. Who's next? Veamos. Volunteer o nos ayudaría ahí Flora a escoger a alguien. Volunteer. Así nos apuramos y terminamos el juego. Me? Okay, go ahead. ¿Quién dijo me? Ah, Deborah, yeah. okay. Uh -huh. uh, my, my brother was uh, at the office yesterday. Okay, muy bien. Negative? Uh, my brother uh, was in, uh, at the office Yes, sir. Very good. And the question form? Uh, was my brother at the office yesterday? Very good. Excellent. No points, Sebra. Okay. Uh, What's going on here? Veamos. Okay, who's next? ¿Quién sigue? ¿Quién sigue? Acabémonos ya las tarjetitas. Quiero ver quién se lleva el tesoro. Ajá, volunteer. Casi todos pasaron ya, ¿verdad? ¿Por encima? ¿Por encima? No, de mí. Ok, te voy a go ahead. Ok. Uh, I, I was buried yesterday. I was buried. I was buried uh, for, uh, no, for the movie. I was bored during the movie. During the movie. Mm -hmm. I was buried during the movie. Mm -hmm. mm. Negative. Uh, Negative, I, I wasn't worried, worried uh, during the movie. And the question? And was I worried uh, during the movie? Okay, very good. Let's see. <gasps> 60 points. Thank you very much, Deborah. Okay, you found a ring. Encontró un anillito. Ajá, Boris, dígame. My brother and happy. My brother and happy, okay. My brother was happy in his graduation. Oh, okay, very good. Negative. And my brother wasn't happy in his graduation. Mm -hmm. Was my brother happy in his graduation? Okay, very good. Is it 20 points? Very yeah. good. Excellent. Okay. Let me see. What about what about ¿Qué me falta? Bueno, hoy sí ya se puede repetir, ¿verdad? No hay ningún problema. You can raise your hands if you want. Who wants to continue? O diga me, teacher. Nos I was clean the house. Uh, Edgar, okay. Edgar, remember, el, es el verbo to be, ¿verdad? Los otros verbos son los que vimos en el ejercicio anterior. Edgar, no se escucha. Ya no nos escuchó Edgar. Como que se le fue la señal. Eh, let me see, Basilia. Yes, teacher. My brother. Uh -huh. My brother and party, okay? My brother was party last week. Okay, my brother was in the party, party. last weekend, okay? In the party last uh -huh. My brother wasn't party in the last week. 
in the party last weekend. In the party. Uh -huh. And the question four? Was my brother in the party last weekend? Excellent, very good. Let's see. <gasps> no oh. points, Vasilia. <laughs> okay, let's see. And uh, who's next? Thank you, Vasilia. Can you see? Ya solo me quedan cinco minutos, okay? Five minutes. Who's next? Se pueden repetir, no hay, no hay problema. Go, go um, ahead. Okay, Emma. Uh, Helen and Tom. Uh -huh. Bored. Bored, board, okay. Yeah. Helen and Tom were bored in the house. Okay, very good. Negative. Helen and Tom weren't bored in the house. Okay. Were they bored in the house? Excellent. Tada! She found the treasure. Okay. Okay, good job, Emma. Thank you. Okay. Who's next? Can see? Ya que nos faltan dos, cuatro, seis tarjetitas. Okay. Who wants to continue? Me, teacher. Go ahead. I was um, in the party. Okay. On the beach. I was in at the, I was in the party at the beach. Okay. At the beach. Mm -hmm. Um I was in uh, the party on beach. In the in, in the, the beach. beach. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um was my um, was my party? No. Uh, Sería was I, was o puedo preguntar, I, were you was también. I, uh, was I uh, in the party uh, on the beach? Okay, let's see. No points, I'm sorry, oh, but thank you very much, Tina. Okay, who's next? ¿Quién sigue? ¿Quién sigue? No, teacher. Vaya, vamos, Anita. Uh, Helen and Tom uh -huh. are happy. And happy, okay. Uh, Helen and Tom were happy together. Oh, okay. Mm. Uh, También puedo usar they, ¿verdad? Sí, claro que sí. They weren't happy in the party. Ok, no. muy bien. Uh, were Helen and Tom happy together? Ok, very good. Let me see. Anita, no points. Ok, my no. puto. No. <laughs> But thank you, Sarai. Tell me. Hey, I was. I was. Office yesterday. I was at the office. At the office. Okay. I was at the office yesterday. Mm -hmm. Um, I wasn't uh, at the office yesterday. Mm -hmm. Um, what? Uh, yeah. What? I was at the office yesterday. Excellent. Very good. 70 points. Ok, very good. Bueno, de hecho, sería segundo lugar porque después de los 200 points tenemos los 70 points y así van para abajo, ¿verdad? Ok, thank you very much. Then, uh, bueno, aparte de Sara y alguien más que quiera participar, tengo two minutes, dos minutos. Ok, two minutes. ¿Alguien más? Three cards. Nobody. Ok, very good. Do not worry. Lo vamos a dejar ahí entonces, ok. Eh, bueno chicos, quizás nada más recordarles que, miren, yo hoy estaba que, yo aseguraba que era martes ahora, pero no, ya me vine a revisar y ya vi que es miércoles. Eh, solo eso chicos, recordarles que la inscripción va de la mano con la finalización pues o el, el completar, ¿verdad? La plataforma. Así que yo quiero felicitar a los que eh, ya lo han terminado porque hay unos de ustedes que yo sé que ya terminaron su plataforma, así que los felicito. Bueno, es más, levanten la mano, quiero ver. Levanten la mano quien ya terminó. Let me take a look. Aquí tengo la pantallita de las manitas. Pero... Ok, raise your hand. Mi okay. teacher. Excellent. Mi, ¿Quién me dice? Mi, Dina. Dina, ok. Yo también, teacher. Vaya, Dina y Anita también. Uh, veamos. También nos ha levantado la manita Saraí, Araceli, Edgar. Eh, Florcita, Basilia, Boris, ok, todos ellos también ya terminaron. Si se fijan, son bien poquitos, pero los, los invito, ¿verdad? Que probablemente el tiempo, ¿verdad? Yo sé que, pues, 
durante la semana para algunos de ustedes es un poquito más difícil, ¿verdad? Pero los felicito por el esfuerzo que hacen y también por acompañarme durante la clase. Y pues ya vieron que hoy la clase la hicieron ustedes, ¿ok? Prácticamente pues era, era poner en práctica lo que ustedes han hecho porque a veces, ¿saben? A veces nos, nos sucede de que se nos quedan las reglas, se nos queda a veces este, eh, la estructura, pero cuando ya nosotros queremos expresar nuestras ideas, ahí ya nos quedamos. ¿Y cómo era? Verdad? Entonces, eh, hay que practicar, ¿verdad? Eh, les recomiendo también este, que sigan practicando a través de ejercicios. Y yo sé, chicos, que hoy eh, yo les fallé porque yo tenía que haberles mandado la información, pero sí tuve un inconveniente en mi otro trabajo y no me lo permitió. Pero eh, mañana, pues, eh, yo estoy segura que voy a poder hacerlo. ¿Verdad? Es más, ¿se acuerdan que lo anoté en mi libreta hablando aquí? Se andaba con el gran pesar aquí en mi corazón que no se los mandé. Así no de importa, que... aunque sea retrasado, lo recibimos. Sí, sí. Excelente, entonces mañana lo, lo voy a mandar. Igual, chicos, mañana pues quisiera mandarles eh, lo, la última parte de ejercicios para que usted siempre practique, porque igual siento que la práctica siempre es importante. Así que cada vez, dígame. Una pregunta. Aquí la queremos, teacher. Ay, thank you. Yo también usted, a ustedes, dígame. Usted mencionó este, al principio... La inscripción para el principiante 4, algo así le oí. Eh, fíjese que yo creo que eso lo hicieron la semana pasada, ¿verdad, chicos? Sí, pero, pero a mí no me dio la opción de principiante 4, solo hasta 3. Eh, no, solo Anita, Ani, perdón, es ya intermedio. Sí, ¿verdad? Ah, sí. ok. Es ya intermedio. Ah, medio primer nivel. Ajá. Ajá. Ah, pues ah, perdón, Anita, ya uno, la confundí. No, no, no. Ay, yo estaba afligida porque quizás me equivoco. Uy, ya, ajá, ya me sacaron, dijo Anita. <risa> no, no, chicos, bueno. este, entonces gracias por la aclaración ahí a, a su compañera. Este, entonces sí es intermedio. Así que eh, nada más, igual si ustedes tienen dudas, ¿verdad? Las pueden dejar aquí en el chat y yo luego se las paso pues a nuestra coordinadora que es Elena o a veces ella ve directamente, ¿verdad? Y les responde. Así de que, guys, aquí los dejo. Thank you very much for joining. Ok, gracias por pasarme un poquito más de esa energía que ustedes tienen y pues la verdad es que me hicieron sentir muy bien durante esta clase. Pude ver que han practicado, que ahí tienen sus apuntes y aunque estuvieron viendo ahí la lista de verbos, pero me, eh, solo con que ustedes los encontraran quería decir que ya la habían leído. Así que, thank you very much, ok, and have a nice evening y nos vemos mañana que es nuestra última clase, ok, nuestra bien, última clase. Bye, bye, pues. bye. Cuídense, bye, bye. Buenas noches, bye. 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 bye.